Hey, you guys. It's literally me. No, I'm looking pretty good today. <laughs> I'm Bunny. Sometimes I buy stuff, sometimes I say stuff, and sometimes I do stuff. What's up, guys? Thank you so much for clicking on this video. This is a good one. All right, today we are going to be unboxing or kind of like opening the Macy's Luxury Advent Calendar. Get a little backstory here. I know it's the time of year where a lot of people are doing advent calendars and I kind of wanted to do one. I did one last year, but it was like a $12 profusion calendar. I really just did it for fun with hubs. I was like smoking a hookah. We were laughing at like all the eye glitters. Like that's, I ended up throwing a lot of it away and giving it a lot away. So I wanted to get one that like I really wanted the stuff in and I did a lot of research and I landed on this one. There is a couple things in here that I definitely wanted, and so this was on my radar, and I had it in my cart on my Macy's app. It originally retailed for $120. $120. Now it is full of all luxury items, so I get the price point, but like, you know, it's teetering on that line of like, do I wanna spend $120? I mean, like I don't, but I was prepared to, but I kept it in my cart and like every day I would open the app up and I would check the cards and just see that if it was on sale because Macy's runs like sales for Black Friday and all that, like all the time. And like every day I checked and it was still $120. And I was like, ugh. This thing is just not going to go on sale because it's all luxury items. Like, I get it. I get it. But then this one day I opened it up and it was half off. Half off. Meaning it was only $60 and I was like, bye. <laughs> Not only did I get the calendar because it was only $60, but I also threw in a pair of black boots and a sheet set <laughs> that were both on sale. So I actually got all three of those, like total with tax and everything for like $102, which is less than the original price of the calendar. So happy bunny over here. That is the way to do it. This calendar does boast of some really awesome items. I did look at everything on the back. Now listen, I was about to spend $120 on it. So I definitely looked at everything on the back to make sure that I wanted stuff in here. There is one item in particular that I really, really wanted. And then like the rest of them are just bonuses. There are a couple that I definitely wanted, but I did do the math. That's right, I went through every single item and I figured out how much a full size was and then divided and multiplied and all that stuff to find out exactly how much these sample sizes that are in this calendar are worth. So we're going to add them up at the end and see if, I mean, I definitely made my money back, right? Let's talk about the box. It is gorgeous. This box is gorgeous. It's heavy cardboard. It has gold leaf on the front. It has a beautiful maroon bow on the side that you open up to some a beautiful maroon drawers that are all very craftfully numbered. This thing is gorgeous. Definitely worth the $60 price point. I would go as far to say it is worth the $120 price point, especially seeing all these other advent calendars that people on YouTube have been unboxing. So super excited to go through this so that I can actually use the stuff. Let's get started. All right, like you saw, you open it up on the side here and then here are all the beautiful drawers. I don't really want to like ruin this. So maybe it's better if I move over here. All right, let's start with, of course, door number one right here. This is how they slide out and oh, look at that guy. I love how they just have it like kind of set in the drawer so it's not like you're just like pulling out a loose item. This is a little sample size of the MCM perfume, which is an item that I have been wanting to try. You know I'm bougie, you know I love fragrances, so this is definitely on my radar. I actually have been wanting an MCM backpack for like a really long time. Maybe one day a Sunday baggage video will come up where I actually unbox one. Here is the little sample perfume bottle. Now obviously this is not going to be a spray, this is going to be a dabber. So the top comes off like this, there you have your little dabber. Oh yeah, I mean, it's a designer perfume. What are you gonna say? You know, it's very, 
It's very pretty, it's feminine, a little tiny bit unisex maybe, but this is so cute. Now I did the math on this one. This comes in a 30 milliliter, which is one ounce, and that runs for $73. And since this one is a seven milliliter size, this actually is worth $17.09. So really, really cute. I really like this one. Oh my God, so adorable. This is gonna look so adorable in my little minis collection. Honestly, door number one, we're off to a great start. So let's go ahead and open door number two. And in this one, we have a Lancome product. This is the Lancome Absolute Soft Cream. So this is just a face cream, beautiful little mirrored container. This is a five mil of product. I did look at the original online. This also comes in 30 milliliters, which is one ounce, and it is $150. So for the five mil of this, this is worth $25, $25. Right here in this little box, I'm very excited to give that a try. I love me a night cream. Now we have this big drawer for drawer number three. Let's pull this baby out and oh, we have an SK2. Okay, if you're not familiar with SK2, it's a very expensive skincare brand. It looks like we do have one treatment mask here. And I did look this up on the SK2 website they do sell these in packs of 10 and 10 of these masks are $145. So if you do the math, this is worth $14.50. That is a pretty expensive sheet mask if you ask me, but it's super excited to try it. I have been wanting to try the SK2 line for a while now. So I'm very happy with that one. All right, three boxes down. We're, good. We're getting pretty good here, right? Like this is semi exciting. Drawer number four down here. Let's go ahead and open this baby up. I'll again, package so cute. This is another skincare item. This is the Peter Thomas Roth Vitamin C Serum. I did look this one up as well. I am excited to try this. Um, you know you can't mix retinol and vitamin C together. So, you know, I have to like move away from the retinol for a night or two, and then I can try this one out. This also in full size is 30 milliliters, which is one ounce. It runs for $105. So if you do the math, this five milliliter little sample size is worth $17.50. You know, I'm not minding drawers over $10 here. You know, <laughs> I've seen a lot of advent calendars where people are opening up these like little dollar items. No shame in that, but you know, it's nice to get something nice every once in a while. Let's go to door number five over here. Again, a nice luxurious drawer. Oh, look at that. We have some Armani Beauty in here. This is the Armani Beauty Eye Tint Chrome. It looks like it is in the shade Rose Gold. Love it, love me a good neutral. Here is the actual packaging, super cute. Not really into liquid eyeshadows, but I have heard good things about this, so I'm excited to try it. Obviously, did look this one up. This actually, this is like the craziest math here. When I looked at the full size of this on Sephora, the full size is actually 3.9 milliliters and it runs for $36. This is actually three milliliters. So only 0.9 milliliters off of a full size. So that makes this baby worth $27.69 crazy crazy believe me i like a triple quadruple check that that it says it on there i also converted it to ounces and the math all stayed the same so hey you know almost 30 bucks for this little armani beauty i tint mm, can't be mad at it we're halfway there did i mention that this is a 12 days of holidays a luxury calendar i wish it was 24 don't we all but look you're getting these really good products okay this one's easy because it's at the top this is door number six Door number six has some YSL in it. Guys, I'm becoming a YSL stan. You probably saw that I had an unboxing the Lulu bag in my Sunday baggage video. I actually have another YSL bag for a Sunday baggage video coming up. I actually bought a couple of their cosmetics. I'm kind of a stan right now. I, I don't know. This is the YSL Touche Akla, Touche Akla. Touche Eclat Blur Primer. Super, super pretty and super excited to try it. I have seen this on the YSL Beauty site as I have been perusing for what I wanna try next. 
very pretty bottle it does look like there are some gold flecks in there so super luxurious i did look this one up again one ounce of this in full size is worth 56 dollars so the 10 mil is worth 18 dollars and 68 cents so super excited to try that this is a lot of product in my opinion too for a primer so super happy with that one i'm not complaining at all all right that was our halfway mark and i have been super happy so far i have I haven't seen the one that I want yet, but let's open door number seven. I want all of these things, but <laughs> let's open door number seven. She's right here. Okay, okay. Oh, this is a good hair brand too. This is Virtue. This is the hair oil. Very excited to try this one out. You guys know that I am an Olaplex hair oil fan. So very excited to see if this is any good. I'm looking at it through the uh, blue thing. You can't see it, but it looks really, really pretty. This is actually a nine milliliter sample size. The full size is 51 milliliters and it comes in at $45. So if you do the math, this little bottle right here is worth $7.94. So excited to try that one. Gosh, I'm excited to try a lot of things, huh? I mean, who wouldn't be? These are like top brand name things. And so far, I feel like you get a pretty decent amount. So here is door number, door number eight is the one. Guys, this is the Estee Lauder Diamond Eye Cream. Now listen, first of all, I need a new eye cream. I have been kind of riding on the eye cream sample train for a while, and I've been using this by Essence that I really, really like. I got it free at Sephora with one of my orders. It was a three milliliter size. It has lasted a very long time, and I actually really do like it. But this, guys, this is some serious eye cream from what I have read online, and it's a five milliliter size. So super, super good sample size that will last you a really long time as far as an eye cream goes. Now listen to these stats. The full size of this is 15 milliliters, and it runs for $295. $295. This is five milliliters, which is a third of the full. So do that math. This is worth $98.33. $98.33. That is almost two of these calendars already. But I am so excited to try this eye cream out. It's just, it has such good reviews. And I mean, the packaging is so gorgeous. Actually, if you buy the full size, you get a little golden spoon applicator. But like, Lord, spending $295 on an eye cream. I mean, like, I, I don't foresee myself doing that in the future. But, you know, I do use some Barbaserm uh, skincare and that shit's really expensive. So maybe, but so happy to have the five milliliter size because this will definitely give me a chance to like use it and see if I like it. I'm just, I'm over the moon for this one. That was day eight. Super happy with that one, obviously. So now we're going to go to day nine, which is this drawer right here. Again, I love how these are packaged, like super nice. This is the Clay de Poe Softening Cleansing Foam. This actually seems like a pretty decent size here. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. So you're getting a lot of product there. You can definitely use that for a couple washes. I did look this one up. This is a 20 milliliter sample size. The actual full size is a 40 milliliter. So this is actually half of the size of a full size. The 40 milliliter runs for $25. So that makes this one $12.50 but not gonna complain about it. It is one of the more inexpensive items in this box, but not gonna complain about it at all. All right, guys, we're getting down to the wire here. We got door number 10 right here. <gasps> you see that, right? It's a YSL Libre perfume sample. Oh my gosh, I am so excited about this. I have smelled this in store and I just haven't really bit the bullet to buy it because it is a designer fragrance and I'm more of like a niche girl. Oh my gosh, look at this bottle. Uh, again, YSL stand right here. Oh my gosh, this is so gorgeous. And look at how much perfume is in there. This. This is definitely a nice little sample size. I love getting this instead of those little two milliliter spray bottles. This is gorgeous. I do love the way that this one smells. I do wish these were little spray bottles, but oh, it's just, it's beautiful. Oh, it's like sweet and spicy. 
Oh, I love that. I love that. Do you know how cute that is going to be in my minis collection? All right, let's go through the math. A one ounce 30 milliliter bottle of this runs for $95. And this is a 7.5 milliliter bottle, which is our decent size. This is a decent size. So this is $23.75 worth. I think that's perfect for somebody that wants to like experiment with a perfume. So super happy to, oh my God, I love this so much. Oh my gosh, we have two days left and how could this get any better? Like I'm, I'm floored. I love it already. Okay, door number 11 down here in the corner. Let's, okay, what is this? Oh, guys, it is a little Tom Ford lipstick. We got Tom Ford in here. Like, this is in the shade Casablanca. Oh my God, how adorable is this? It is just a little mini like his other lipsticks. Let's check out the color. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I love that. I love that. This is super cool. I love this. Great little mini size too. I love that it's like the actual lipstick, but it's just smaller. This is great for the purse, by the way. So on Sephora, 2.8 grams, which is a full-size lipstick from Tom Ford, runs for $59. This is one gram of product. So this actually is worth $19.60. So very happy about that. And it's a good size to definitely try a lipstick, like instead of like spending the $59 to see. I love these little minis like that for that. That it's just it's perfect. All right, guys. This is the last one, door number 12. You know, everybody wants the last day to be good. So let's see how this one pans out. <gasps> There's two things in there. There's two things in there plus a card. Oh, dude, I totally didn't even know that that was coming in there. So they do give you a coupon for $10 off your next $40 beauty purchase at Macy's. <laughs> I will be using that. Thank you very much. If you want to buy one of these products full size, you can get 10 bucks off. I mean, that's that is such a bonus. But there are two things in here. So let's pull these bitches out and see what. OK. Oh, my gosh. Two Carolina Herrera products, which like getting two things in the last day, especially designer items like this is um, like pretty good. Let's see, the first one is the Good Girl Liquid Blusher, which is really, really cool. This is in the shade 1070 Rose Jasmine. How adorable. So this is just, I guess, like a little liquid blush. So you can like try it out. Oh, that is super cute. I, I love all of these things. If you guys want me to like, do a little like swatch or like test on these. Just like comment down below, let me know. But that is super gorgeous. And then the other item we have is the Carolina Herrera Fabulous Eyes Mascara. What? Oh, a designer mascara? Yes, please. Oh, how you know, you guys know I love this packaging. Oh, the black and gold, I love it. Let's just go ahead and see what the brush looks like. Okay, yep, that's uh, pretty typical for a designer mascara brush uh, with that fat end on the tip. Yep, that kind of reminds me of the YSL Lash Clash, so definitely gonna give that one a try. I can report back if you even care. So that was super cool for the last day, getting two designer items plus the $10 off coupon. That's pretty much the best I've seen on any last day in an advent calendar thus far from anybody on YouTube. So very happy with that. The thing is, is when I did a little bit of research on the Carolina Herrera stuff, I could not find the weight in milliliters or grams on any website. I checked them all, even her website, I could not find it. So I am just going to assume kind of like at the pace that the rest of these have been, I'm just gonna slap a $10 on both of those. Like that's just kind of what we're gonna do to like get the total value of this calendar. So let's just like play along with it. Okay, so that was the 12 days of luxury for the Macy's Believe Advent Calendar. It does say on the bottom here that there is $290 worth of stuff in here. And honestly, since I have been tallying them up, you can probably assume that that is pretty close, but let me give you the actual numbers. 
Now again, my number might be just slightly inflated because of those Carolina Herrera items. I don't know if they're worth $10 a piece, but I just put them in here. But all those other ones, check out because I did the math. If you add up all 12 items in here, even though they are all sample size, we have a value of $302.56. Unbelievable. I paid $60 for this thing and I got over $300 worth of luxury items in here. Every single one of them I want to try and I want to use. There's not one thing in here that I would gift or kind of just let go in my makeup drawer. I wanna try every single one of them. So to me, that $60 was totally worth it. That's all I have for you today, guys. What did you think? This is an awesome advent calendar, huh? Like, I don't Comment down below if you think this was totally worth $60. If you don't, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know how to talk to people like you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think it's really important to research and do a lot of things before you spend your money on things, especially in this time of the year where there's like deals everywhere. So I knew that I would pay $120 for that. And even if I did, I would still get my value, but I was waiting it out to see if I could get it for less. And I did, and I'm super happy about it. If you could please like this video, it really does help me out. Comment down below on if you love any items in here or you would love to try any items or if you are just wowed by everything that was in here, that would be awesome. And if you could subscribe so you could follow all of these antics, that would be the awesomest. I love you guys so, so much. I will see you on the next one.